on today. Well, mom always said take your vitamins, and we have proof tonight that she was right. Scientists in the United Kingdom have documented actual repairs in muscle fibers triggered by D3. As science specialist Ed Yates reports, it reinforces what Utah researchers have already discovered. I had an ACL tear, and I also actually broke my ankle on the same exact leg. Athlete Jake Benson has come a long way since his injury last year. Um, it was about eight months of recovery, and then uh, cleared to pretty much do everything about after 10. Now here at the Orthopedic Specialty Hospital, or TOSH as it's called, Jake is strengthening muscles, hoping to play football at Utah State next season. This is a fairly routine pattern athletes follow, making the most of the time it takes to recover from an injury. But what if you could wind the clock the other way? It's happening. In continuing studies over the past three years, researchers at Tosh have been inducing muscle soreness and weakness in healthy volunteers using this machine. The difference? For 28 days prior to the induced muscle damage, some volunteers take 4,000 units of vitamin D3 per day. These studies are double-blinded, meaning for scientific accuracy, one group takes the actual vitamin D3, while the other group takes the placebo. Dr. Tyler Barker says 36 months of data shows significant results. And what we found is that the group that received vitamin D, there was about an 8% greater increase in muscle strength from immediately after that muscle damaging event through the first 24 hours. What does that really mean? The vitamin D3 cuts the recovery time almost in half. Tosh is in a unique position for research since this is a gathering place for those with all kinds of athletic injuries, plus those needing knee replacements. Though the extent of damage or the level of vitamin D in the body prior to an injury all plays a role in how well the supplement works or how much is needed, the evidence is promising. The better your vitamin D levels are, the better you're going to recover from muscle injury, the better you're going to recover from an ACL, ACL injury and surgery. And the more probable strength you'll experience in a leg with symptoms of knee osteoarthritis. So it's quite remarkable. Though Jake Benson never participated in the Tosh trials. It's definitely worth a try. I mean, it sounds pretty good. Ed Yates, KSL 5 News at Tosh.